Proportional valves are considered both flow and directional valves to meter flow and control the direction in which flow is metered. Proportional valves use pulse width modulation to vary current while they maintain voltage. Varying the current modifies the force of the magnetic field and subsequently how far the spool or poppet moves within its body, changing the size of the opening available for fluid to take, which of course limits flow. A simple variable resistor can limit current, but it is inefficient and cannot provide a PWM controller's benefits. Older proportional valve designs employed a spool valve with metering notches and PWM ready coils to infinitely vary the spool position. The performance level of these proportional valves left much to be desired, but was the least expensive option to vary flow and direction simultaneously. Having no way to control accuracy in the face of changes in pressure drop, the actual flow rate through a prop valve will vary based on changes in flow, system pressure, and load pressure. For proportional valves to achieve any level of performance close to a motor-based servo valve, advanced electronic control was required. Because a standard coil-powered prop valve was susceptible to flow forces, a feedback method was required to maintain the spool in its desired position. Linear differential transducers came to the rescue to monitor spool position down to microscopic distances. The transducer signal feeds back into the valve's onboard electronics, and when it senses the spool outside of its desired position, the valves adjust the PWM output to the appropriate coil to bring it back in line with the desired position. Proportional valves have evolved to be quite sophisticated. The frequency response, accuracy, and hysteresis come close to flapper valve performance and sometimes even surpasses them. In fact, a whole new breed of valves called high response have taken the proportional valve to near servo valve performance. A high response valve is a relatively new term used to describe valves whose performance is variable, dynamic, and powerful. Previously, only servo valves running technologies such as a torque motor can be classified as high response, but with the proliferation of contemporary electronics, feedback and programming, proportional valves have closed the gap. Now some proportional valves match the performance of servo valves. New designs can include self-contained media separated electronic proportional flow control valves. Using different positions or steps, these valves can precisely regulate flow output and require minimal power to maintain a desired position, maximizing energy savings. Proportional valves, in many cases, look exactly like the spool valve they're based upon. Cartridge or seat top valves, for example, are hard to tell apart from their bang-bang counterparts. Proportional valve spools require metering notches so that even a minute valve shift allows a throttled volume to flow. Proportional valve coils must translate their incoming power signals into a variable magnetic field that tugs the plunger which in turn shifts the spool to varying degrees. The pulse width modulated signal produced by the electronic valve controller maintains a constant voltage but varies the length of time the signal is on. By varying the pulse width, the valve controller essentially varies the current to the valve to control the strength of the magnetic field, thereby the metered flow output from the valve.